Hello everyone, it's been more than a month since all the fans of The Witcher were upset that Henry Cavill was leaving the series after its third season. As you may remember, quite a lot of interesting things have happened since then, for example, we learned about a new spin-off called, Rats, in which, by a strange coincidence, there is no Freya Allen. Many sources reported not unfounded information that Henry left because there was a conflict between the actors and the creators of the series on the basis of a different approach to how Netflix shoots The Witcher and others, but the main reaction of at least someone from the show's team did not follow until recently, when the showrunner of the series Lauren Schmidt Hisrich, apparently out of desperation, decided to break the silence, even I was surprised that she said that I propose to sort everything out right now, but among other things, there has been a good one for almost a month the petition you and I know about the return of Henry, and instead of him, the creators of the Witcher series will be eliminated, and this petition is already approaching 300,000 signatures, without even thinking about slowing down, perhaps, also for this reason, due to the completely obvious and not hidden irritation and disappointment of the audience base with everything that is happening. Lauren Schmidt finally could not remain silent anymore. This happened against the background of the announcement of the new spin-off The Rat from The Witcher, in which Lauren Schmidt returns to business, as well as against the background of the release of the final trailer The Prequel, The Origins of Blood, starting on December 25th, where Lauren is also actually, in general, this lady, just a nurse mother, apparently, the universe is from Netflix, so she had to eventually take responsibility for everything, because if in the end people's anger gets out of control, as they say, then Lauren Schmidt will not be able to stay not only in the showrunner's chair of The Witcher, but also will fly out of all other projects of this universe from Netflix, the creator of The Witcher, in an interview with Thrudar to promote the spin-off, The Origin of Blood, Lauren Schmidt gave several very ambiguous signals. She not only refused to confirm or deny rumors of behind-the-scenes discontent and conflict, which occurred between the show's team and Henry Cavill, but also urged those who are ready to turn away from The Witcher to give a chance to the third in the zone, and also stated that the controversy should not overshadow the upcoming spin-off, so she seemed to be trying not only to completely bypass the topic of Henry's departure, but and he pretended that let's not do it now, although the most important thing, in fact, The Witcher's runner publicly addressed the audience for the first time, saying that kind people give us another chance, don't turn away from us, look further what we are doing, agree, we haven't seen anything like this before, and this tells me about the growing uncertainty within the Witcher team. This is not surprising, judge for yourself, in fact, if the viewing figures of season 3 are not at the proper level, then season the 4th of May not even get the green light from Netflix, and this now is a very real prospect, because everyone knows about the financial difficulties of the streamer and that he is no longer able to produce dozens and hundreds of unprofitable projects for himself. So this is an interesting dilemma for fans. What to do to support Cavill's latest appearance in the image of a white wolf? Or deliberately ignore it in the hope that the main show will then get a red light? The Witcher is waiting for curious times, that's for sure. Let's discuss this dilemma in the comments under this video. Well, at the moment it seems that Lauren Histrich's comments have raised more questions than answers. Will Lemhamsworth be able to breathe new life into Geralt? Will the show continue to function without its main star Henry Cavill? And will we finally find out the truth about his departure? Let's discuss this issue in the comments, because that's all for today. If you don't want to miss anything, it's time to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell, and also don't forget to give a thumbs up. Thanks to everyone who was with us.